Hey guys, it's Dave from TheUnlocker.com and in a previous video I showed you how to root the Nexus 6 and flash custom ROMs and do all that sort of fun stuff. But in this one, I'm going to show you how to undo all of that and return back to stock and unroot in case you're kind of done messing around. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is download the toolkit um, that I'm going to use for this. Uh, you do need Windows to use this toolkit, but it does make things a lot faster and easier, so I suggest you use it. So you click that link there to be taken to the developer's site. Please donate to him if this did help you. Uh, any little bit helps, and it's a pretty serious toolkit. More information to download links. And then here is the download link itself. You're gonna uncheck the dev host download manager, click download now, and save that to your desktop. Once that's downloaded, we're gonna right click the toolkit and run as administrator. Hit yes, click install, and wait for that to install. Eventually, this should pop up. Uh, you're gonna choose which one you have. I have a Nexus 6. And you're gonna choose the build that you currently have, which you can find under settings about phone. And then click apply. Okay, then we're gonna plug the device in to the computer via USB. And we're gonna pull down the notification shade, tap up at the top, tap the gear, go to about phone, scroll all the way down to build number, and keep tapping that until it tells you you are a developer. Then we're gonna hit back and tap on developer options and tap USB debugging, okay, and enable OEM unlock as well. And then we're gonna wait for our drivers to install. After the drivers install, you should see something pop up on your phone about a RSA key. If you don't, the drivers probably didn't install properly. So I'm going to open up my charms menu, type in device manager, open that one. And then you're gonna see here, I have an exclamation point next to ADB interface. So I'm gonna right click that, update driver, browse my computer, let me pick, and you can do ADB interface and hit next, hit next, hit yes. And now it should be installed. And if that worked, you'll see the RSA key I was talking about, hit always allow, hit okay. And now we can get all the downloads that this guy is gonna download. So just click download and update all file dependencies and wait for that. At this point, the toolkit will open. If you didn't get that RSA key thing, you can go in here now and actually do this um, uh, driver installation guide and try to get it to work. Uh, but since I've already got it, we're just gonna move on. Okay, then we can click this flash stock and unroot and we're gonna say device is on normal if it is on and on the normal home screen. Otherwise you can use the soft brick boot loop option if your device is stuck in a boot loop. Uh, mine's on, so we're just gonna click that, flash stock and unroot. And it's gonna let you know this will erase everything on your device. Uh, uh, click OK. Then select the Android 5.0.0 build. I tried the 5.0.1 but it actually caused a boot loop for my device. Um, so just do the 5.0.0, hit automatically download and extract. Um, you can leave this off, it's gonna do it for you though. Hit okay and follow the prompts to let it flash. Then you can click okay once you see the device has booted into fast boot mode, it'll have the little Android with his stomach open and wait for that to finish. Once that's all done, we're gonna leave it in fast boot mode, we're gonna click OEM lock, click okay. Once it's done, the device will say locked on the screen again, um, you can hit OK to continue and it'll reboot the device. And there you go, you're unrooted, you're back to stock, you have a locked bootloader. Uh, you can even apply OTA updates from Google now. If this video helped you out or if you liked it, please thumbs up it and share it, it's greatly appreciated. And if you wanna see more videos on how to get the most out of your devices, hit the subscribe button up at the top. And as always, thanks for watching.